Hello and welcome to My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Diamonds in the Rough. <laughs> it's a dog pun. Oh, Big Mac! Do you think you could watch the bumps? It really is rather difficult to knit when the cart keeps bumping up and down. You wouldn't want to ruin one of my lovely sweaters, would you? <sighs> nope. I hate to seem ornery, but I ain't really sure why an emissary to the princess is knitting sweaters at all. Seems like maybe we ought to be trying to figure out why we got two royal imitations for two different queens. Meadowbrook, darling, I'm sure that's just a mistake. And as for the sweaters, we are emissaries to a race of dog creatures who have tons of very expensive rocks. And if there's anything I know about dogs, is that they need cute sweaters. And perhaps we could arrange a <clears throat> trade. And since we have Maud along to evaluate those rocks, uh, where is Maud anyway? Gangway. Boulder said he heard you calling for me. My goodness, Maud, where have you been? Discovering something shiny and expensive, I hope. No, but Boulder and I have made several important geological discoveries. They will keep me writing papers for years. I am very excited. Oh, well, to each their own, I suppose. Oh, speaking of our new canine friends, I think we're here. Hello, my name is Rarity, and I am an emissary from Princess Twilight Sparkle of Equestria. Go, Carl. Go, Carl, go. So, we should just take the cable car, then? Mine. Mine, Carl. The car is yours? It's very nice. Kind of a strange cable car, though. That's because it's not a cable car. It's a mine car. Nope, nope, nope! I disliked that tremendously. Yup. Agreed. It was fine. Now look at that. Wow! Look at that! Two completely separate castles. Think that might have something to do with the two invitations? Now, Meadowbrook, smug self-satisfaction is very out this season. Greetings to you, emissaries from Equestria. We have been awaiting your arrival. Welcome to Gainania. I'm Princess Moonbeam Twinkletail, but you can just call me Moon. And this is my sister. Who can introduce herself? I am Princess Ambrosia Muffin Buns, but please call me Amber. And tell me, who are you and who does your mane? Is every pony in Equestria so well quaffed? I am Relity, and they wish. I had no idea I would be the Diamond Dog with so much fashion sense. To be frank, the diamond dogs I've met in Equestria have been... They're very distant cousins. I love them, but fashion is not their forte. Well, looks like they're gonna be good friends. The rest of you can come with me. Let's go see my sister, the Queen. Visitors? It's been so long since I've had visitors. Please, Jen, don't strain yourself. Be careful. Nonsense, Moon. I am... <coughs> Sister! That was embarrassing. It's okay. Go slow. Thank you, Moon. I am Queen Janino Lanternlight. But that is such a mouthful. Jen will be fine. Now tell me, how was your trip here? I used to go outside all the time. But since my illness, I barely get out. Well, your valley really is lovely. And the riding is... Something else. Yup. Ah, oh, the go car. I love those things. We use them all around the kingdom. Um, Rarity, should we be asking about the two invitations? One says Queen Janino, but the other one. There is plenty of time for that. It would be very rude to butt in right now. We are excited to begin this new alliance. We have heard so many stories about Princess Twilight. And we have so few trade partners. Tell me, Rarity. Do you not like diamonds? Because we have a lot of them. I think I'm in love. 
I wish I could show you the kingdom, but as you can see, getting around is quite difficult for me. My sisters will give you the tour of the castle and grounds, and then tonight we feast. We're sparing no expense for our guests. This is the magic library my sister bought for me to study. It's full of books and spells and potions. This is the royal spa, my sister's present to me. Yeah. Now that is quite the presence. This is the Queen Lantern Light Academy. All puppies can come and learn from the royal tutors. The royal academy is open to all. Impressive. And these are the gardens where we grow. Golden apples? Rarity. Okay, okay. Ambrosia, darling. I hate to interrupt, but... What am I looking at? Oh, well, that's the other kingdom of Kainania. There are two? Yes, and it's actually run by our other older sister. How many of you are there? Six in all, though we haven't seen our other three sisters in... Years! It's been years since I've seen Fiona! They're twins. She gets very sensitive about it. I cannot blame her. If I had to go that long without seeing my sisters, I would be very emotional too. Rarity, we have to do something. How did this happen? Jen, Amber, and I were out digging for gems in the royal mines. That's part of our duties as princesses. Well, mostly Jen and I were digging, and Amber was cheering. I know where my gifts lie. We discovered an entire new vein of gemstones connected to the mine. It was gorgeous, but there were these strange creatures I'd never seen. We returned home to our sister, the Queen, to ask permission to continue exploring this cavern. But she said it was too dangerous and refused to let us continue. It wasn't the first time she had told us no. All Katharina cares about is tradition. She had kept me from learning magic for years. She said it was too dangerous. All Amber wanted to do was decorate and design the castle. But our sister forbade her from changing anything from the way it had always been. And even though Jen was the best climber and digger, she made all sorts of rules about where Jen could explore in the caves. Jen convinced us to break away from the pack, but our sisters decided to stay. We built a castle that was everything we wanted. We built our own kingdom. And we did it with the gems Jen mined from the new cavern we've been told to ignore. But then Jen got sick, and Katharina refused to let our sisters come visit. She said it was Jen's own stubbornness that made her ill. This has been going on for years. Have they even tried to make up? No! They're both too stubborn! I used to do everything with my twin sister. But I couldn't be me there. And now she can't visit me here! <laughs> you all are in luck. Fixing friendships is Rarity's specialty. My specialty is rocks. Well, I would say between Maud, Big Mac, and I, we've dealt with quite a few conflicts between sisters. We will visit the other castle and see if we can sort this out. Now, how do we get there? I was walking! I never thought I was walking! Regret in eating all those apples now? Yup. Yes, visitors! I'm Princess Fiona Flappy Ears, and this is my sister, Princess Indiana Ember Eyes. Call us Fiona and Indy. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. We weren't sure you got our invitation. Yes, well, there was a bit of a mix-up with the invitations. I'm Rarity, and... Wait, Fiona, you're Amber's twin? You two don't seem like... Like we've been apart for a day? Like we've been without each other for so long? Like you can even tell us apart? How is Ambie? Oh my god, I love my twin so much. But I understand that she had to leave to do what she loved. Sometimes I wish I'd gone with her, but I couldn't just leave Indy alone. Are we still just alike? Why, you're just the spitting image of one another. I knew it. I just freaking knew it! Do you hear that, Indy? No. Fiona said that she didn't want to leave you alone, but I thought... My older sister takes being queen very seriously. 
It's her sacred duty. It doesn't leave time for much else. Speaking of which, she'll be waiting. We should go. Until next time.